We've only begun. Amen. I believe that. I have. I. I believe that we're going to see the Spirit of God moving and just take us in areas of hilarious joy. Hallelujah! Not just joy, but a hilarity in the joy. Hallelujah! Praise the Lord. I'm so glad that we don't need to be ashamed of the rejoicing before the Lord. Hallelujah. This is one of the things that I like also about Israel. I like the way that the folks dance in the streets, uh, singing songs of praise to the Lord. Uh, Hallelujah. Dancing to songs like, Therefore, uh, with joy shall ye draw waters uh, out of the well of salvation. Uh, Hallelujah. Having the joy of the Lord to come forth. uh, So that when we're dancing, I've seen the old men dance uh, more vigorously uh, than some of the young folks here can. Uh, There is a sense uh, that they have been redeemed from the hand that was stronger than them. And in connection with that redemption, they joy in the presence of the Lord. Hallelujah. In our ministry in Jerusalem, on Mount Zion, it is a praise and a worship ministry. And if anything, if the praise has changed in the last several years of being there, it has become more joyful. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. A joy that is coming forth. Hallelujah. A joy in the Holy Ghost. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Are you getting all your thrills in Jesus? Are all of your delights in Him? Are you thrilled when He is speaking to you? Are you thrilled with His touch? Are you thrilled with the hand of God that is being manifested in your life? Are you being thrilled with the blessing of the Lord that is coming to your soul? Then if you are, let us show our joy in Him and let us rejoice before the Lord with great rejoicing. Hallelujah. Makes no difference how much your hands move or your feet move, but let that joy bubble up. Amen. When the joy bubbles up, it's going to come outside. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. People always say, oh, I'm dancing on the inside. Amen. I'm rejoicing on the inside. And their faces are long. And you can see that turned down mouth. They could have fooled us, couldn't they? We just couldn't see that rejoicing on the inside. But God wants to bring, hallelujah, a rejoicing within, hallelujah, that becomes evident without, hallelujah, that will come into the very heights of Zion and be able to sing and rejoice to the goodness of God and see the corn and the wine and the oil flowing out in abundance. The harvest of the Lord, bless the Lord, for he says this, he's going to turn our mourning into joy and cause us to rejoice from our sorrow. I will satiate the soul of the priest with fatness, and my people shall be satisfied with my goodness, saith the Lord. Hallelujah. We're just learning more and more how to rejoice in the Holy Ghost. Oh, ha, ha. Hallelujah! How to rejoice in the Holy Ghost. We don't want you just saying hallelujah. But if you'll let that hallelujah roll. There was an old uh, hymn in the Pentecostal hymnals. uh, And it said, uh, 
the shouts I can't control. And we used to sing that song about the mighty sea. Hallelujah. The love of God coming over us like a mighty sea so that we couldn't control the shouts. And then we got modern. And all the Pentecostal hymn books changed the words. And wherever it said the shouts I can control, they said the Savior to extol. Because they could control them. Amen. They could control that uh, those shouts. They didn't have too much shouts uh, that they had to control because they had suppressed it uh, and suppressed it uh, and suppressed it uh, and quenched the Spirit of God until Jesus walked among them. It was sort of ho-hum. No excitement, no thrill. But God wants us to live in the thrill of the Holy Ghost. There's no more exciting life than to live in the Holy Ghost, to be led of the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. To minister in the Holy Ghost, to have the visions of the Lord in our eyes and the hearing of the Word of the Lord in our ears and to feel the power of God soaring through our being. Oh, under the shy, the kingdom of God is righteousness and peace and joy in the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Let not the, the joy wither, but let the Holy Ghost cause that joy to begin to flourish again. Amen. A flourishing in the Holy Ghost that we've never had before. Hallelujah. Our Heavenly Father, we pray tonight that thou shalt continue to minister unto this people. Lord, we want to be those that come and sing in the height of Zion, those that rejoice in the goodness of God, those whose delight is the Lord. Hallelujah. Those, Lord, that are clapping unto Thee, whose hands are uplifted unto Thee, whose feet, Lord, are dancing unto Thee, those who mind not the opinion of man, but those, Lord, who only desire to please the Lord. Take the fear of man, inhibition, self-consciousness is away. And, Lord, those that have sorrow, let them rejoice from their sorrow, Lord. Let them rejoice until their sorrow is moved far from them, until the memory of it is not even there anymore because of the rejoicing in the Lord their God. Hallelujah. 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 I want us to...